So what's the best way to find cheap land for sale? In this video, I'm gonna walk you through that, but just know, after the video, if you're interested in learning more about raw land investing, check the description down below. We have access to our video series showing exactly how to buy land really, really cheap, 20 plus videos in there. On top of it, if you need help building out your land investment business, there's places where you can work with me one-on-one -on -one with that, and that can be found at landflippingmichael.com. You came here to find cheap land for sale. So I'm gonna walk you through exactly how to make that happen. Cheap land could be found anywhere. It depends on what market you're in and what's considered cheap for that particular market. If we're talking waterfront in Miami, cheap might be $150,000 versus the millions it goes for for that waterfront. If you're in Nowhereville, Texas, cheap land could be $1,000 for an acre to a property. So wherever you're at, we gotta determine where cheap is. So for this video, let's go ahead and pick something random. Let's do Tennessee in this video. So for Tennessee, let's say we're looking to buy some cheap land there. What I would do first is I would go to Zillow.com and in the search bar on the homepage, I would just put Tennessee in there. That's it. Then I would sort through the different filters on there and I would remove houses, condos, apartments, all that stuff. I would only check land. Then my next step would be I would filter the prices because I don't want a gazillion listings to show up. I want cheap land. So within the filters there, I would go ahead and go from $0 to $10,000 for the max. And then I would click search and I would see what would pop up in that price point. We're not committing to anything here. We're just seeing what's going on in the state of Tennessee from zero to $10,000. Now, if we're getting a lot of results, we're off to a good start here. We wanna take note on what the size of the property is and what the price point is that's going for in this area. Now, if you find a mind blowing deal like this right off the bat, go ahead and contact the agent and purchase it if you're happy. But my gut tells me you want to get a little more strategic and you want to get land even cheaper than that. So now that we have all of our notes here, we see how cheap it's going for in the state of Tennessee. And we've narrowed in on a particular county in there that you're thinking, I would love to own property there, but I want to get this thing really, really cheap. Your next step is to contact a data company. Now, I use offers to owners.com. What I would do is reach out to them and say, I'm looking to purchase properties in XYZ County in the state of Tennessee. I want to mail all the owners of property that live out of the state of Tennessee that own lots of this size, and I want to go ahead and give them an offer price of whatever your low ball offer is going to be. So for an example here, let's say you're finding a bunch of properties for $2,000. You want to pick these things up for 300 bucks. So we're going to reach out to offers to owners, say all the people that own property in this county in the state of Tennessee that live out of state. I wanna go ahead and send every one of them an offer of $300 to purchase their property and just see who says yes. Now, this could be a little cringeworthy if you're new to the game, but you never know who will say yes to your lowball offer. So you send out a thousand offers and you will get a lot of FU responses, but that's okay. We wanna know what the market's gonna tell us. But out of those, you may get two, three, five, ten 10 accepted offers. That's fantastic. Let's go ahead and purchase these $2,000 properties for 300 bucks. We're gonna take the title to them, and then we're gonna go ahead and flip these things for $1,800 and profit on them. Or we'll flip a few and keep the rest of them for free just if you want them in your portfolio. Whatever your exit strategy is, is absolutely fine. But that's how you find cheap land anywhere in the US. We're gonna do some basic searching. We're gonna determine what the value is. From that value point, we're gonna go ahead and send out offers. We're gonna buy it that much cheaper and then we're gonna go ahead and flip for a profit or just keep it for personal portfolio, bragging rights, whatever you wanna do. That's the whole game in a nutshell there. So if you have any more questions about the land investment game, go ahead and drop those down below. You could text me at 440- 5676040 or if you want to know all the strategies I use to buy land really really cheap check the links down below we have our course in there 20 plus videos breaking all that down or if you want to work with me one on one you can get that at landflippingmichael.com thank you so much for tuning in i look forward to connecting with you in the next video